Hello and welcome to the car guys. This week we're at Goodwood Motor Racing Circuit for a Romans International Track Day. We're here to watch some really interesting machinery and we'll show you some stuff a bit later on. As an incredibly slowly driven caveman comes past. <laughs> Today we are at Goodwood Racing Circuit, we're on a Romans International Track Day and um, we're going to take a look around some of the cars that are, that are here to come and play today. A 720S, very nice grey, I quite like that. Brand new 720S, yes, yeah, so um, nice little yellow highlights it's got on it which is pretty cool. Oh yeah, I like the yellow highlights inside, that's pretty cool. And those headlights. So brand new, just been delivered last week. And it's on a track day. Already getting fair track, play yeah. to the man. Obviously, the car guy's um, 675 LT. See more of that in a while. 488. Not sure about that blue, it's a bit dirty. A bit girly blue, I think. A bit girly, one. isn't it? Yeah, I have to say. What else have we got lurking around the back? GT. It does look like a GT, doesn't it? You can never tell the difference. <coughs> I can't tell the difference between GTs and yeah, it's a GT. GTSs, GTRs. GTS, SLSs. What the hell? This is a GTS. You see, you can tell. You can tell. You know that. Can't tell the difference because it's a GTS. Yeah, you can tell the difference because it's got an S after the GT. Does the S stand for stupid? The S does not stand for stupid. So in black, very very subtle car in black. We've got the obligatory well, Porsche 911. Turbo case, S. Yeah, Turbo S. It's Convertible. Good, it? Very nice. Not the day for it particularly because it's pitting freezing. And another 488. Another 488. Common as muck, clearly. This one's in quite a nice, this is almost chicane grey, but it's in a nice sort of grey colour. There's a lot of grey here today. There's a lot of grey here today. It's, this yeah. is obviously the new supercar grey colour. 488, stark grey, 918. Oh! Grey McLaren, grey McLaren. Glossed over the 918 though. <laughs> Uh, 918 Spy. What have we got here? Oh, tasty. Look at that bad boy. Watching this thing come out of the pits earlier. Absolutely sh shot off like a rocket. Yeah, that is a stunt. This is a stunning car, isn't it? Look at that. Look at those exhausts. I know. And look how at the cool colour of them as well to show how hard he's been trying. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Look. It's the colour of NASA. <laughs> is it's it? the colour of Saturn V. Is it really though? Yeah. Look at that. That's proper, that is. Amazing. Look. look at that. Yeah. Green brake calipers, very nice. Left hooker as well. Another 911 Turbo S, common as muck. Yeah. And a GT3. And a GT3. Hello. Hello, sir. Hello, little cheeky GT3. What are you doing? lurking around the corner in your subtle grey. Yellow seat belts though, yellow calipers. Mm. Last yellow seat belts I saw were on MG Metro Turbo. <laughs> oh, proper old school. <laughs> right, carbon ceramics on it, very nice. Very nice. So what do we think now we see these in the flesh? They're definitely growing on me now that I've seen them. They don't, pictures don't really do them justice. They don't do all the curves and all the active aero body justice, I don't think. I still don't want one, but I'm not in a kind of deep seat of my loins want. Coming in. It's 
So what is it about the door handles on the 488? They look like an aftermarket bit that's been picked up from Halfords and stuck on the side with a bit of super glue. I mean, that's got to be one of the worst bits of design I think I've ever seen. I think we can all agree that the 918 is a, is a special machine. It's very subtle, but everyone knows it's just super, super cool. Look at it. I wonder is it a bit too subtle for a supercar though? Like, you know, the supercar that it is, its stable mates are the P1 and the LaFerrari. But I don't like the P1. I, I, that does nothing for me. Controversy, it, ladies and gentlemen, is controversy. Is you throw down the mic and say, <laughs> that's it, the car guys are over. I don't know you at all. Get out. Don't talk You're to me again. dead to me. Uh, so let's explore this uh, 911's yellow ri wheel rims. Which, yeah, yellow wheel rims on I the mean, 911. You don't often see this on uh, heterosexual men. <laughs> These are obviously uh, an afterthought. Uh, and we can tell they're an afterthought because on this side of the vehicle... He's lost one. He he's lost one. one. I think um, I think it may be somewhere in Goodwood Racing Circuit. <laughs> Okay. Right, look at those exhausts. Look at the blueness. Of course, the problem you have with circuits like this today is that people move near them and then they complain about the noise. So it means you have draconian noise limits. Um, it means you've got to lift off as you go around the tracks, which is really annoying. But these guys don't care. They're going out for a good old track day today and we're about to join them. See the red dots on the windscreen that means that he's been over the noise limit three times so he's strictly speaking shouldn't actually be out there but that was formula one star max chilton about to spank a porsche 911 four liter rs Not hanging around. He's reasonably having it. Reasonably it? having it. What have we got oh, here? Speziali uh, chased by a 675 LT. <laughs> I wonder 
why they were going so fast. <laughs> He's moving, wasn't he? <laughs> personally never been to Goodwood before. Today we're out in the 675 LT. This is a proper old school circuit. Wow, this thing's so fast. <laughs> so quick. <laughs> it's gonna be an easy 150 on there, if not more. Wow, 150 miles an hour down that straight. switched on, Damien's a lot happier with the way the car feels. You can actually feel it more planted. It's still skipping, but you could, it feels like it's working the car much better. Yeah. Coming up to the famous chicane. Sling it in, right, then left, get on the power nice and early. I thought he wasn't. He is a nutter, that guy. Getting held up a little bit here. Because we're good track day goers. We wait for the invitation before blowing his doors off. Bloody hell, why is he breaking mid bend? Because he's frightened. Remember our last video when we took this car to Anglesey, it was absolutely soaking wet. We didn't really get a good track day there. It's good to feel what it's like on a dry surface. Yeah. It moves around quite a lot more than I was expecting it to. Yeah. Brakes took a little while to bed in as well. But man, is it quick. Once those tyres get a bit of heat in them, you can really feel the grip is quite enormous. Yeah. Woo. Now that's was that, a, that's a fast car. It's a fast car. <laughs> oh. Let's have a close up of the exhaust. Look at the colour of these bad boys. Look. I couldn't get any more blue. Yeah, literally, we have this track to ourselves. Oh no. Ooh, hello, bit of wheel spin. So that was session four. Session four. Feeling a little bit queasy. Damien's getting a bit too um, confident, shall we say. So a couple of those corners were, we had to get out of it, shall we say. That's, uh, that's probably the, that's probably the most delicate way of putting it. Cut it, cut it, <laughs> cut it. Get used to the track first. That's barely touching the throttle, promise. 
space. So yeah, that's Goodwood. <laughs> Car guys track day at Goodwood, done. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys and don't forget to subscribe. What are you gonna say? Is that it? Lots of thanks to Roman International for organizing the track day at Goodwood today. It's been a, a brilliant day, we thoroughly enjoyed it.